Kyrie, first game for these new-look Nets. We knew there would be peaks and valleys in the first game with just one practice. But how would you assess how this game unfolded overall in the field that you guys had as a, as a group? Honestly, too long. <laughs> just two OTs for the first game back. Man, hey, you got to love you gotta love NBA basketball, bro. So, you know, we definitely tried to come out and compete. I, I myself was just – I was just doing my best out there to pace myself, you know, and, and just I know that, you know, it's going to take me a little – minute to just get up and down a few more times but you know I'm excited you know I'm just excited for the future I, they, Cleveland threw a lot of things at us you know to start the game they threw zone they, they forced us in some positions that um you know we're just a little uncomfortable and I turned the ball over in the first quarter you know we had a few turnovers and we limited in the second half but you know they scored 20 points you know in the second OT you know, we, I don't, I don't know many teams that could put up 20 points in five minutes, but they did and Colin got hot. So I give the young fella credit and um, I give that whole Cleveland team credit tonight. You know, they, they came to play. You talked about how your teammates have had your, get your back. Uh, first game in 15 days for you. How did it feel emotionally to be back out there with your teammates? Uh, man, always playing the game that I love. I'm grateful. So I never take it for granted. And then also to be, you know, playing with Kevin Durant, James Harden, you know, just those names alone right now, just like we're we're having some fun, but it's not just about us. And I always say that, you know, we we're, we'll have good nights, we'll have great nights, but it's how we galvanize this group um, together and how we sacrifice and compromise for the greater good, you know. And that that still remains to be seen. Obviously, one game's out the way, but I'm excited for what's to come. You know, Brian Lewis, New York Post. Hey, Kyrie. Um, Two-part question. I'm curious. I mean, obviously, seven games that you didn't play. How did you feel? Um, I mean, it's a lot of minutes <laughs> that you logged. How did you feel there? <laughs> and when you look at the defense and the overtime, I mean, was that – was part of that, you think, just fatigue overall? Uh, or was that just being unfamiliar with each other? Uh, man, that's just being human, honestly. <laughs> you know, we, we've come together. You know, I've been away for a while. Uh, the team's been doing incredibly well. So, definitely wanted this first one as a group. Um, but like I said, you got to give Cleveland credit to a certain degree. You know, a lot of opportunities that we had to extend the lead or, or take control of the game, you know, they came back and hit a three or they came back and responded and they responded all night. And, you know, it's just one of those nights and you got to give credit to them. Uh, and then for us, we just take accountability for what we could have done individually better. And then collectively as a group, we'll watch film tomorrow and see where we can get better. So. Greg Logan, Newsday. Uh, Kyrie, uh, as you said, you guys have to take responsibility for the loss. But at the same time, the big three scored 96 points tonight <laughs> and scored 42 of the last 57 points, Nets points tonight. So what do you say <laughs> chemistry you guys showed first time out of the block hey i i think any one of us would definitely take a win <laughs> over all those you know just great stats you know those are sound incredible <laughs> for a first game out for a few great teammates uh just first time touching the floor but like i said we're we're not so much consumed about what we can do you know we're we're more or less responsible for you know like i said putting these pieces together and making it work and offensively, it clearly wasn't enough tonight. You know, we still needed to get stops on the other end. So that's going to be the tale of our season is how committed are we to that end of the floor moving forward. And, and like I said, these are just words, you know, until we meet it with actions and we go out and do the little things and um, we prepare a little bit better, uh, you know, and I, and I don't say that to uh, mistake my words. I'm just saying as we prepare better moving forward, you know, we're just kind of throwing in these last few days. So just putting it together and, and we just got to keep smiling and having fun. Like I said, I was smiling when Colin Sexton was hitting all those shots, man. Like it's just, it was one of those nights for him. You know, he gets an offensive board, they tie it, you know, it's, they're down one now, KD hits two and then he hits a three, they tie it. It was just like one of those nights, you know, and being back in Cleveland, it, it was rightfully so one of those type of games, you know, like, hey, back and forth. So I look forward to playing them against Friday, playing them again Friday and we'll see how we fare that game.